So, in case you did not know, here in Nigeria, there are different kinds of plantain and different ways in which plantain is eaten. We have the kwekere. The kwekere is a dried one. Most times it's unripe and then it's dried and it's sometimes sold on the road when you're traveling from Lagos to other parts of Nigeria. Then we also have the ukodo. Ukodo is usually eaten in the southern part of Nigeria. It's made with pepper soup, spices and catfish and all that. And then we have the, which one again? Oh, dodo. Dodo is fried ripe plantain. Sometimes it's fried in oil and it's overripe and everything is just soft. Those are my favorites. And today we're going to be focusing on bole. Now bole is a particular kind of plantain. It's roasted and it's eaten in different parts of Nigeria. Some people eat it with groundnuts. Some eat it with a special kind of sauce. And today we're heading over to Potakot where if you visit Potakot and you do not eat bole and sauce, bole and fish, You've committed a fundamental sin that is punishable by prevention of entering into Port Harcourt ever again. So today we're going to be exploring the beautiful city of Port Harcourt and their bole and fish. Enjoy. They've come out en masse to celebrate it and put it on the global map. And I feel like joining them. Maybe by the next time they do that, I will be joining them. Bole is a roasted plantain dish. Energy food. It is said to be native to the Yoruba people of Western Nigeria. It is referred to as boli in the southwest of Nigeria and eaten with groundnut. Very rich food. While in the south south part of Nigeria, it is referred to as bole and eaten with fish and palm oil. I see bole to be one of the natural things anyone can eat. The bole festival is held in Portakot with the theme, Our Taste, Our Culture. The annual event focuses on promoting local delicacies precisely the popular local snack made from plantain. Now, bole and fish. Now, me the men, men, bole. Away from the festival, bole is sold on almost every street in Nigeria. It is served in different ways, depending on which part of the country it is sold. In parts like Lagos and its Envar, bole is often served with pepper sauce, roasted fish, yam, or potato by the side. Now, people will not know anything about bole. Now, they use granola, they chop them. In Enugu and other southeastern states, it is mostly served with pepper sauce, uba, and otazi leaves. Bola is a rich food. It's a non-rich food. It can nourish your body, make you feel good. Everything about bole is so special. When you talk about the taste, I want to eat bole and granos, not bole and fish. I like bole and fish because it can carry for long. Ah, I like bole and fish very well. The way it's been prepared. Yes, bole and fish, now be the number one. And the food, you, you find out that it's so natural and, and good. Now they think they're sweet, well, well. The reason why I'm coming for bole is because I'm having a stomach upset. And I know that bole unripe will help me to quench it. According to visitors at the bole festival, this is a good way to reconnect with friends, the culture, and of course, enjoy the local delicacies available at the festival. I'm just, I'm enjoying myself. Really nice. Enjoy. This is better than last year, so we're hoping to see more and more and more things to, you know. Oh my God, what place is that bubbling like? It's for the best It's wonderful, at least I can connect with people that have been lost a long time ago, lost contact with a long time ago. I'm enjoying the food. I've seen too many people, Sha. I want to run away. This is for and we know how to keep it real. The nature of the preparation of the delicacy may not be considered hygienic, but the absence of toxic preservatives is good for customers' health. This is why local delicacies should be strongly emphasized among Nigeria's nutrition mix. Well, it's, it's nice. We, it's one of the native food we can easily get now in River State so easily. It's a good food to me. It's a night food. I like it. But I know, not be saying not everybody. If you get the money, you go eat them. If you don't get the money, you go still buy like 15 naira old, just to test them. And even maybe you are hungry or not, you take bole, you feel that leg yet, you take something good. That's why everybody likes bole. And that's the reason why it's everywhere, because the food that everybody likes. Even white man self likes bole. I like bole and fish because if you eat them like this, eh, you go come belly full. Well, only be said the bole na na rich man food. But that cut bole, they special for bole here. That is why 
We can't blame Bole Festival for River State. The Bole Festival has established itself as one of the biggest festivals from the south-south of Nigeria, with over 8,000 people in attendance. The Bole Festival is aimed at promoting and showcasing the rich, unique preparation of the roasted indigenous delicacy in order to boost tourism. To enjoy more of this our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.